Yo, what's going on, 67 Lunders Squad? Today we're here doing a ranked 1v1, and I'm playing Loki today. You might be wondering to yourself why. Why are you playing Loki, and why am I going to unsubscribe and never talk to you again? Well, hold on. Here's the thing. I actually... Okay, I have three stars on Loki, but... No, I have two stars on Loki, but let me explain. No, I have three. I have three stars on Loki, but let me explain. I play him ironically and aggressively. Unlike other people who play Loki, like actual baby bag bitches, I am aggressive. And on top of that, somebody donated for a Loki video. So I'm gonna do I'm gonna do a Loki video. And I'm gonna do the pumpkin skin. Headless, what is it? Headless Norseman. I don't like his jawline. I don't like how they how they gave a pumpkin a jawline. It doesn't really make any sense to me. Because he's got a stronger jawline than I do. And I'm a human. But, alas, it doesn't really matter. It's a video game. So, <laughs> you know, who knows what's going to happen. All right, we got two stealth boys. Uh, one of them is arguably better than the other. Yes, I'm talking about Al Kwong. But one of them is also me. So who knows? Who knows what, what's going to happen here? All right. Honestly, I'm thinking we go Transcendence, but then there's a part of me that's like, what if we just started Jotuns? Ah, uh, man, I don't know. I'm going to do this. And I'm going to go Meditation because Executes. And I'm going to go Claw Shard because more damage. And then I'm going to level one point in everything... Yeah. Yeah. No. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna do one point and everything. Alright. He's over there. We we see him. We're peeping. We're peeping. Nice. Success. Actual success. Thanks for the blue, bozo. And if I know anything about Al Kwong, it is that he cannot play the video game if he has no blue buff. Ow. Ow. Yeah, look at his mana, dude. Look at his mana. There it is. There it is little claw shard action a little a little abandon on the red buff for some extra damage on the human now i'll do the red buff now that i already killed him once i will full commit not that i could pick it up or anything but you know i just kill him again right well not if i don't know where he is all right well played, sneaky boy. Um. Damn it. Oh, God, I'm low. He's not level 5 yet, though, so I'm chilling. Does he get 5 off that wave? Oh, God, he did. Okay. So maybe I'm, I'm less chilling now. I'm going to med. Oh, damn it. I didn't need the med. I thought he was going to, like, be aggro, jump over the wall, do some weird shit. But he didn't even come close to doing any of that. He ran away. All right. He goes Bancroft. So I go Transcendence. I kind of want to go... Well, I don't know. There's two types of Loki. There's the Loki I like to play that's Transcendence Hydras and I one-hit him. And then there's the Loki other people like to play where you go Crusher and Heartseeker and you kind of AFK. And just poke with your two until they're low enough to kind of damage. I do so much damage to him, dude. I can kill him so easily, I feel like. 
Yep, I can. Give me, give me the fucking, give me the minion, man. No, I'm going to I'm going to make this video because because I'm so confident in my abilities and because somebody paid for this video, I want to make it a little bit more interesting than just playing Loki. I know that he recommended just playing Loki, but like um I want to make it a little more fun. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to not do any tower damage ever. No tower. I might do Titan damage cuz Titan is technically a minion. So I might hit Titan. <clears throat> but I'm going to take Tower and Phoenix without ever hitting it. That's the Gazame plan. Alright, he got one buff, so I've officially done a bad job at playing Loki. But I clear so fast, man. I feel like I do so much damage. And I should be scared of an Outquang, but I just really am not. That's a bad call. Shit. Don't touch me. I'm scared. I'm actually scared. Okay. All right. I'm not scared anymore. Oh, is he coming? You coming? Are you coming? Oh no, he wasn't. He wasn't coming. He wasn't coming. My next item. Um. It's kind of a big deal because I'm kind of thinking beat stick here. Because, you know, obviously Al Kwong has a healing passive and he has a Bancrofts. So beat stick just seems like a natural thing that you'd want to grab however i'm also kind of thinking what if i just got crusher i'm gonna get crusher so and here's my thought process one it's 10 percent pen beat stick has no pen i mean it's got base pen but it doesn't have percent pen um and two, Crusher gives me some attack speed, which helps with fighting, and more power than Beat Stick. I lied, it's actually less power than Beat Stick. Fuck! I should have gone Beat Stick, man. Why didn't y'all stop me? I do feel like I do a lot of damage, though. Mm. I'm going to need to do Bull Demon, and I'm going to have to kill him a lot. In order for me to actually do what I want to do for this video, which is not ever hit a tower, I'm going to have to murder him at minimum probably 10 times. Which is fine. Like, it's not that hard to do, I feel, but... I want this blue buff. I want cooldown. I'm sick of having no cooldown. <laughs> oh my god, dude. That life seal. I really I really need a beat stick, man. What is he doing? Where'd he go? Okay. He has no mana. I guess he probably has enough mana to kill me if he wanted. My guy is so scared of me. Alright, my next item... 
I don't know. So here, dude, I want beat stick. But I really want cooldown. <laughs> I really want some cooldown, man. I could go Hydras. I mean, that's percent pen and cooldown. Um. All right, let's go. Look, look, cooldown, power, pa power, cooldown. Ah, fine. I'll go hide. I'll go beat stick next item. Okay, I promise. I promise I'll go beat stick next item. If I don't go beat stick next item, you guys can thumbs down the video. Not that it matters because YouTube took away that option a long time ago. Uh, I mean, you can still do it, but I don't see it. So, you know, my feelings don't get hurt as a creator. <laughs> but, um... <laughs> but you can. I mean, you can dislike it if you want. Uh, let's see. Oh. That was, that was a good ult. Honestly, not a bad ult. He did beads as well, though, which was not great. Oh, I can't hit tower. Oh, what? Damn, that did way more damage than I thought. Honestly, I killed him with beat stick there. I almost ruined the entire premise of the video. All right, I need to go blink because he's running away from me and it's infuriating. No, I should probably go beads. No, I'll go blink. I'll go blink. Bro, how am I 1.3k up? Um. I'm just doing bull demon. I don't care anymore. Did he do his blue buff? He did. Oh, jeez. That double life steal. The double life steal, man. Oh, jeez. He can probably take tower, too. He's out Kwong. Ah, uh, no, he can't take tower here. Oh, maybe he can. He has life steal, I guess. Damn, he's straight committed. Damn it. I should have gone beat stick earlier. I think I need to go... Maybe I should go Pestilence as well, actually. Because he does just straight up win the fights. Alright. That was great damage. Ow! The tower. Mm. Do not do nearly enough damage to scare him, I think. Not yet. He's going... 
Chronos pendant, maybe? I actually don't know what he's building right there. Oh, Rod. Oh, Jesus Christ, and he already finished it. Slightly terrifying. Nice. Nice. Come on, minions. Take that bitch. Take it. Fucking darn it. All right. Well, we did kill him and we got a lot of gold for it. So that's good. I would. I don't really want blue buff because I want to go my Jotuns now. Or my... Uh, yeah, that's what this item is. I also could just go Arendite, actually. It gives me 10% cooldown and 75 power. I'm now 30% cooldown. Now I need probably a Serrated. Honestly. Serrated would do really well here. Oh, tower's down. Get shit on, doofus. I have no idea where he is, but I do know that I'm committing. I ain't scared of no man. Oh. All right. He just backed out. Let's go. I can't hit that, but don't worry. My minions will get it. My minions got my back, boys. I'll keep I'll keep the minions at bay. You take that. Go ahead. A little faster. Come on. You can do it. All right, they got him. They got him. Let's go. Phoenix down, boys. Tower and Phoenix both down. I didn't have to hit him at all. Now, here's the issue. The Titan. Because I do a lot of damage, but Titan is pretty tanky. So, it's a brother tanky. I don't know why I said it like this. It's kind of tanky. It's a tanky Titan. <laughs> yeah, good laugh, Loki. I do so much damage. Damn. So much. Oh my god. 740. What the heckle? Alright. Now is. We gotta like. Be very strategic here. I can only fight him when I got minions coming in. So that if he dies. Then I'm getting maximum overdrive dam. On Titan. Oh, oh my god. Okay. Now I did hit the Titan a little bit. But uh that's just residual. I never autoed him. And I'm pretty sure that he counts as a minion, so it'll still work for no tower damage. It'll work for a no tower damage Loki video. I'm pretty sure. I think. If it doesn't, that's kind of weird. Let's go, boys. GG. Now I have to check the stats, though. It's not game over yet. I got to check the stats page. Dude, full damage Loki does... Well, I mean, when I say it like this, it's kind of stupid, but I was going to say full damage Loki does full damage. Uh, Details. Structure damage zero. Let's go. Completed. Completed. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, if you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe.
Thank you to whoever donated for the Loki. I know your name, but I'm not going to tell it. Um, all right. Peace out, boys.